Virgil will probably appreciate these mushrooms. Oh, maybe he'll make white kibble when we get back. Cap, what do you think of Virgil? You trust him? Virgil's a smart man and a reliable medic. Until he got our pilot shot, you mean? Whatever Cox was saying about Virgil's past clearly upset him. I need to know what it was about. What's on your mind, Captain? Cox said you were hiding something. Something that Belters wouldn't like. Cox is a habitual liar. First, he tried to murder you. Then he tried to deflect blame onto me. So there's nothing else you wish to share? Nothing you're hiding? No, Captain. No more than anyone else on this ship. I found some mushroom powder for you to cook with. <sighs> Bursting with umami. Exceptional. <laughs> Thank you, Captain. Get some rest, Virgil. Will do, Captain. He just can't help himself. Say what you will about Virgil, but he takes his job as ship's medic very seriously. The one thing I know about Virgil is that he's an excellent doctor. The rest is a mystery. These have gotten more use than anyone could have imagined. What is the good doctor hiding? For an inner, he does make an excellent red kibble. Looks like Virgil has some anxiety from his past. Glad to see he is managing it. Virgil's private computer. Must be something here. Never thought I'd be thankful for Cox's snooping, but that encryption key I found in his office should work. Virgil grew up on Luna, but he's not like Summons. He actually thinks of Belters as people. Apparently, there's a lot Virgil hasn't shared about his past. Like his time as a UNN soldier.
So Virgil's not even Virgil. Whatever he's hiding, it was enough to make him change his entire identity. Not only did Virgil hide his UNN service and his real name, he's also wanted by his own government for desertion. I should try to get more information from him. What's on your mind, Captain? You served in the UNN. As a medic, yes. It was the only way I could afford medical school on Luna. Hmm. Why did you desert? Because I was finding it harder and harder to live with myself. Being stationed in the belt, I was surrounded by people in desperate need of my help, but because of the badge on my chest and the gun on my back, I was their enemy. One day, it became too much to bear. Did you do something? No, I never hurt anyone. I never raised my gun, not once. But what I saw taught me that there were two sides and I was on the wrong one. I'm sorry, Captain. I hope that my actions on this ship can offer some amends for my past. Why should I trust you? Because I sacrificed everything I have to get away from my past and start a new life here in the belt. You seem upset again. I'm sorry. I don't like to be reminded of my past, but I will endeavor to earn your trust going forward. Get some rest, Virgil. Captain, is my UNN past going to be a problem for us? You were stationed in the belt. That means you were occupying my home. I know. The way I see it, you're wanted by the UNN for desertion. I'm wanted for fighting them. Sounds like we're both on the same side. Thank you, Captain. <laughs> 